California Garden Homes neighborhood of uh, Northside Urban Milwaukee. And the walk that we just led was intended to inform people about the historic nature of garden homes, but also connect them with the storm water, the water that falls not only in this neighborhood, but everywhere in the city. It was a way to integrate the conscious water features that are being installed throughout the city to combat some of the flooding issues and water runoff with art. Uh, the walk we just led was looking at three different redevelopment projects that all involved green infrastructure and stormwater management and how that interplays with the communities around it and the fact that the sites are formerly contaminated brownfield sites. I was asked to do the Watermarks Walk as an artist. I came up with the title Restoration and Reclamation because it felt like a no man's land out here. It's a little intimidating to most people when you talk about infrastructure and engineering and things like that. So, so art brings water and the infrastructure to the surface and it tells a story in a way that people can understand and relate to. You go to 50 different meetings and you're meeting with engineers and urban planners who are pulling out maps and then suddenly my brain goes dead. But to be on the ground and to think that this is a wasteland, see the images of how it's coming together, that made it really concrete for me. It was way more fun than I thought it was going to be. I was really nervous about it, but it's cool because people wanted to be here and were excited to learn about stuff. People had questions. It was awesome. I learned a lot about the water features and the technical aspects and the true investment and the history behind it. I think things like this connect us. We find new communities. And the art and the infrastructure and water together, it makes the neighborhood sustainable because people understand the water, they understand why it's important to them, and they take ownership of that water through the artwork. It gives them pride in their neighborhood and it makes them understand the function of their neighborhood on a level that they didn't previously understand.